I mean, getting cows, trying to get, do my job, get cows across the road, only to be met by this individual with his, with his dazzler. To point out that he was trespassing on my land and to prove it. Uh, the intimidation, the aggressiveness of him, and to drop me on the road that when I was totally blinded by his torch, his dazzler, that was about seven, seven inches like the light of a car, and to leave me in the middle of the road for whether it was a second or a second and a half, it wasn't long, but to see him jogging away and to leave me on the road. And luckily enough, I had the conscious to get the hell up out of, off the middle of the road and get in front of my own car for my own safety. And, and Tom, it's about a week ago since this happened, how, how will this affect you into the future? Well, every time I'm going to come out into the yard, day or night, and night in, in especially, as, as I live beside the town, every time I hear a creak, crack, I'm going to be looking over my shoulder, and I'm wondering, do I carry a bar with me, or... And, and when I would need a bar, would I probably end up not having the bar. So, I, I am on my own. And it's, it is scary, whatever way I want to go about it. And it is a, a responsible job, it is the welfare of my animals. But there's obviously with these minority, they have no respect and no concern about the welfare of the majority.